So here is my Nixie clock with the six tubes coming from uh, Russia. It's an in 14 tube with a nice logo of the Russian army there. So they display the time. It's an Nixie clock. And um, there is also um, power is done by uh, uh, 190 volt um, step up converter. Uh, an ESP32 is uh, the microcontroller, and uh, the alimentation is done by the power is done by this uh, buck, uh, step down converter from um, uh, 12 volt to 9 volt, to 5 volt, sorry. And um, the drivers of the tubes are the microchip um, HV5530. So at the boot, the, um, uh, the microcontroller is uh, joining the Wi Fi network going to an NTP server, fetch the time, and then switch off the Wi-Fi and open up the Bluetooth low energy. And I have written an application to um, modify the parameter of the clock. So there is absolutely no, no button, nothing. Everything can be done by the, the smartphone. Uh, for example, you can change the, the color of the, of the NeoPixel. So we have added NeoPixel just uh, under the tubes. So you can change the color. There is also a possibility to, um, to, dim, to dim the, um, the tube. So this is done with uh, a light sensor. Um, you can dim the tube, as I said, with a PW, PWM uh, pin coming from the SP32. Um, you have the option to, uh, to fade the display. Here yeah, it's fading. Or to have something much classical without any fading. Um, there is, um, just in front of the, the wood here, you can see it, it's on the back, there is a radar sensor in order to detect any motion in front of the clock, so that it, uh, the tubes will switch off after five minutes without any activity in front of the, the clock. I have also added some uh, depositing system, so it's uh, lasting one minute, during which all the... Um, all the digits are, are rotating with a nice effect. The case is, um, is a wooden, a wooden one. I have milled uh, the, this case with uh, a piece of wood. So it's a single block of, of wood. And uh, finally, I also have the possibility to, um, to depoison any digit I want with, uh, with this application. So we'll see it when the depositioning will, will be finished. Oh, one minute is long. It's almost finished. Okay, now, and it's go back goes back to the previous settings with the same uh, color, the same uh, dimming, and so on. So, if, for example, if I want to uh, depoison the second digit, there yeah, it is. So, it, it is done at full brightness, and you can let it, let it on as long as you want. Okay, so here is my clock. Bye-bye.